Okay, I don't know if they're all in there, but we'll see here. I've been having this problem lately, so bear with me. My camera eventually will get better, um, better uh, focused in the future. All right, Pisces, so what do we have for you this month? Okay, um, it looks like this month is going to require some patience because the one of the cards I pulled for the underlying um, energy for this next two weeks uh, is patience. You're either going to have a lot of patience or you have patience right now, which is fantastic. Um, patience is sometimes hard to do, deal with um, if we don't have it, but it looks like you're going to have patience um, in the next two weeks. Um, you're going to be able to ground yourself. You're going to be able to control your emotions and you're going to be able to, um, you know, get through anything, any kind of challenges or difficulties in a really smooth manner because you are going to have that control of emotional control of your emotions. Now, if you, if this is, uh, you Pisces that doesn't right now necessarily, uh, feel that you are grounded or have that, the, the patience right now then the advice for this month is you're really going to need some patience and that uh, it's very easy to obtain patience. All you have to do, you know, is just really let any meditate through meditation, listening to music, however it is that you guys um, deal with um, letting, letting difficulties go within your mind and then clear your mind and then, you know, look at it from a different perspective and you'll be fine. So um, there may be some patience needed and let's see why. It looks like um, you're feeling really drained uh, a little bit uh, over um, possibly an offer that didn't come through, maybe that you were waiting for or you were hoping for. Maybe you wanted to provide somebody with an offer um, or somebody is coming in with an offer um, and it's not to your liking or you've been working really hard, you guys, and it's just it just never happened. Um, so you're really feeling a little bit um, emotionally drained, emotionally uh, spent, you know, like, you know, you, you've given it a lot, you've given a lot and um, and you've just given enough at this point. So um, I don't think you're going to be I think that's why you need the patience this month, because you, you you're waiting for something, um, an offer and, um, you know, you're at your you're at your exhaustion point. You're like, I've, I'm done. Uh, I do see that you you're thinking about walking away and most likely you will because we do have this card basically saying you're going to be walking away. So I think you're just um, you're emotionally done with the situation uh, waiting for this offer or um, the offer isn't good enough. Um, most likely you've been waiting for something to come in and it didn't happen. So. Um, you're going to, you're going to forget about it now. You're going to leave it behind you. You're going to be walking away. Um, you're going to be leaving it, leaving it in your past. You're just, you're done. Um, in the, in the recent past, um, you wanted more information or you needed some more education. If this is in regards to work, you may have needed some more, um, you might have needed some continuing education. Uh, or if this was a romantic relationship, um, you didn't have enough in, you didn't have enough, somebody wasn't com com excuse me, communicating enough to you, or you were not communicating enough to them. Therefore there was a lack of, um, maybe honesty or, or a lack of, it wasn't just honesty, it just was the information, um, needed in order to make a decision or in order to see things from a clear perspective just wasn't there. Um, and therefore, you know, now maybe you, you, you've gone through a period where you, you know, maybe were hoping for some more information to come through or a new, a new offer. Like I said, this could be a new, uh, you're waiting for some kind of offer. Okay. And it just doesn't come through. Um, so you're going to, you're, you're done. I think you're done at this point. Um, I think what you, you may be, starting your own business. You may be, you may have waited for somebody to go into business with you or, um, to work with, a, with somebody as a partnership or, you know, um, another company, um, or yeah, but you're, it looks like you're thinking about, you know, being independent. Um, you're not going to wait anymore for this for others. You're just going to continue forward. You're done. 
maybe you tried working with others. Maybe you tried waiting, um, tried working uh, out something with somebody. Um, and you're just like, I, I, I got to do this on my own. So you're leaving. You're leaving them frustrations behind and you are walking um, to better things you're just going to leave it you're going to leave it alone and yeah this is what uh this is exactly the other card that is showing up for you um this is somebody who's you know not if this is money this is you holding on to your money you're you're saving your money right now you're earning money but you're also saving it at the same time um, because you are possibly wanting to start your own business, it looks like, or you want to start your own thing, and you're, you may need these reserves for for a later date. Um, because you're, it's an unknown. It may be unknown because this may, this may be something different or brand new, or you may feel like it's a little bit risky. Um, anytime you start your own business, that's you know, uh, and if you've never, especially if you've never done it before, uh, you're definitely going to need some reserves. And it looks like you're doing that, or you've done that already. Um, if this is not in regards to financial, um, this could be emotional. This could be um, some kind of emotions that you're holding on to and you don't really want to um, let your emotions be shown right now. Uh, maybe you're just trying to be strong and um, you're just going to you don't want to you don't want to get too emotional. So maybe you're just holding on to your, your feelings right now. You're holding holding on to your emotions. You don't want to release uh, uh, release that release anything right now because it looks like you're too busy uh, walking uh, on to better things um, so that's fantastic you guys um, it looks like there may be a, a Virgo in your life uh, or in this situation maybe that's what you were waiting for maybe this offer um, wasn't good enough or that didn't come in um, there is a there is a Virgo involved um, uh, or an earth sign of any kind it could be a male or female because this is a general reading and the female or male virgo um they're not feeling very secure about themselves they're not feeling secure financially or emotionally or both um they're looking at the situation with you and they're thinking that it's not very stable or, or there's not enough um there may not the offer is not good enough so that's possibly why you're feeling so drained or why somebody is um, because it seems to be not enough, not enough, not enough, not enough. Um, so you, it looks like also that you've been postponing things. This could be you. Uh, this is, could be a fire sign. This is the, um, this is the King of Wands. He is in reverse. He is somebody who is not taking action right now. Um, if this is you, um, that explains why you've been, you know, you've been waiting, okay, for something, and you've now, uh, you're not going to wait anymore. It looks like you're going to, you're going to walk away, okay. If this isn't you that's walking away, and you're just not putting any effort forward in this situation, well, it's going to take care of itself. The other person is going to walk away. So if you don't do anything and, um, this is, it, it, you know, it appears that this is what, you know, you, you, it appears you do possibly want to move forward, right? Possibly you do want to move forward, but right now the, the other person or you are not doing that. And I really do believe this is somebody else. So again, it could be a, a fire sign. If it's not a fire sign, it's just, it's just a person that, you know, has a lot of, um, it could be somebody with in authority. Um, it just could be somebody that, um, you work with or that you are, were in a, in a relationship or are in a relationship with. And these people could actually be the same, this Virgo, uh, earth sign. Um, it could be the same person. Um, but it looks like there might be more people involved here, but bottom line is you or the other person are unable to move forward right now. So somebody's definitely going to be walking away. They're going to be protect. You're going to be protecting your money, your finances, or your emotions because you know the situation has to end. It's exhausted you, and you're you're you've tried to get information, um, but you just haven't succeeded. Um, and now you're just gonna you're 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 gonna go off on your own at this point. You're gonna start your own business. Um, you're gonna be independent, and you're gonna be just starting your own thing. That's fantastic. If it's not a company or a business, you're gonna start. You're just gonna start anew. You're gonna start independently on your own. Um, you have definitely um, done some work here. 
uh, emotionally by walking away or the other person walking away, it's definitely going to help um, your emotional state. You're no longer going to be feeling this way, exhausted, because you are making this decision or this other person is walking away. You are the other person. It's going to remove all this uh, exhaustion and all this mental, um, any kind of disappointments or um, struggles you've had emotionally. All that's going to be gone. So... At the end of this month, uh, end of this month of February, it looks like you uh, will be moving forward. Uh, that's fantastic because it looks like here you weren't able to move forward before, uh, but by the end of the month, you're going to be moving forward in a very, very successful way. As soon as you walk away, you guys, you're going to be moving forward. Okay, so this is you. Um, this is you, or the uh, or yeah, definitely you. Um, this energy is a. A beautiful male or female but this is somebody who is very successful in what they do they're confident they're successful they have all the confidence and knowledge they needed to go to move forward in something um, and you guys are going to be doing that the minute you walk away or this person walks away you're going to be by the end of the month you'll be starting something brand new um, you know this is you starting a brand new on your own uh, she's independent usually too. this queen um, She's very independent. Of course, this is he or she. Uh, this is this this person is very independent, and this this card does refer to starting your on your own um, independently as well. So you guys might be starting your um your on your own path this month towards something um great and new, and keep having the faith. This patience is here. Just wrap up whatever this is, you guys. Go through it. Whatever it is, it's going away. You already know it's not um, the best for you. You know it's been too much of a work, too much work. It's been too emotional on you. It's been too draining. You know you've had to really guard yourself. Um, you haven't really been able to feel secure because you've been too guarded and too emotional. So as soon as you walk out of this situation or this, you know, the, the other person walks away um, and leaves the situation, which will happen by the end of this month, um, you're going to be walking into some beautiful new energy. So get ready, you guys, to do that. Um, it's going to look, it's going to be great for you. I'd love to know, um, hear about uh, what this new beginning is for you guys. And I'm going to go ahead and pull another, um, one of the goddess cards for you. Please provide a message that they uh, will need for this second part of the month for February. Wow, don't back down, guys. Okay, this is Bridget. She says, don't back down. Do not back down. Stand up for what you believe is right. Stand up for what you believe is right. Um... You guys do know it's right. Uh, I think that's maybe why you were holding back, you know? Um, you were holding back, you were guarded. Uh, maybe you were just not sure, but I, the message here is you guys do know what is right for you, okay? And just because there's other people involved, they shouldn't hold you back. So you have what it takes to move forward and you're going to do it. Okay, guys, I'm super excited for you. So just, just if you have any, um, doubts about yourself this month, um, you know, the message here is you are going to succeed and you're going to be moving forward in a beautiful way. Uh, you're going to be starting your own uh, off on your own and it is what you need to do right now in your life. So go for it, go for it, have the patience. If you need any, take the patience, take deep breaths, take, love yourself for the rest of this month and go forward. 